a flat on the Dalbon trailer. So. What you think? Oh Pretty good. How's it going? Yeah. My bad boss. It took so long. We had yeah. to make sure all the oil and shit was good before we uh, pulled off with the pipe. Yeah. How you doing, yeah. sir? Yeah. Uh, you sign this out for me. This is your name, uh, your printed name, and then your signature. Yeah, gotcha. Yeah, I don't miss these. Yeah, I still got it, but I don't miss this, Dad. I don't miss these at all. <laughs> I'm good. I need a. I want a button to start it back up. That's the first thing I don't like. And then I need a bigger, wider seat, man. This ass is 40 years old. I don't like riding on these seats like this no more. It was fun when I was younger, but I understand like what the older guys was telling me back in the day. Um, what's that radiator fluid we put in there? Uh, uh, engine ice. Engine ice. Yeah, see, I like something like that. That's, That's more my know. style now. You know what I mean? I got lights. <laughs> I'm gonna miss this joint. Well, to the KX, it is. Yeah, you've been a Kawasaki lover all your life. I was shocked you kept it as long as you did. 93. Yeah, I was uh, shocked. The motor oil is uh, 1040. Uh, 1040. Yeah, uh, full synthetic. Yeah, but we have been running full synthetic since we got it. Don't be surprised if you really like it more once you clean it, because we haven't washed it, and it is a really, really nice bike. And I'm actually, I'm a little disappointed you're seeing it in this condition, but it works very well. So, but yeah, when you clean it up, you'll be like, wow, this thing does look good. All I need is a graphics kit. <laughs> It rides really good though. You know, this first, that's really the first time I've rode it on the street. You know what I mean? <laughs> this is the, the longest I've actually rode it since you had it. It actually rides really, really good. And I made sure I didn't mess up any real estate. I made sure I kept the fender nice and clean. <laughs> so I took it back a few times. I said, nope, 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 nope. I'll let it go back. Yes, it is right, there. right here. Is that right there? Yep. Yes, sir. Yes. 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 Because I mean, I mean, shoot, I ride with my my shop on my back, so yeah. it's like flying colors. It's almost like riding in colors, you know what I mean? I have fun, but I'm not gonna get too carried away. Yeah, pull up a little with your hand. Okay, I know that's how I first started because I used to struggle with the neutral a lot. And then this is just the choke right here. Yes. That's just beside the choke. Yeah, it's hitting up under there. So it's on right now, and you flip it up this way cut it off yeah it's got a down arrow on there but it's like that big so you have to look very closely to see the arrow yeah. can you check your oil here that's the that's what we would call your sight glass like so that. what you do is you take that screw out and if oil comes out it's got enough make sure this is sitting level when you do it right. but if oil comes out when you take the screw out it's got enough oil um if not then you add oil until it drips out and then hurry up and put the plug in yes there you go high compression release valve like on the harleys pretty much if they have cams and stuff they have that little pull plunger on the side of the head these have high compression when they're hot so they have it from the factory so if you start racing it you might want to replace it just in case like i say in the middle of the heat you down the bike if you're just tooling around in the woods and in the trails like we were you probably won't ever have a problem with it that's why we haven't replaced it because it was like that when we got it and i told him he asked me the same thing i said look bro if we can't get it started while we're messing with it sure we'll replace it because we need it but usually you only need it at the track when you're you know like pushing the thing to the max right, thank you man appreciate you you ever have any trouble with the joint you got my number you can call me i'm only around the corner so. you're a mechanic right yeah, yeah i build bike Look, not much on a bike that I don't do. Enjoy? Yeah.
You safe? Yeah, please. Do your maintenance.